Hey, welcome to another update. Uh, today I will be finishing up this side, so making this top section, and also the card reader. But then I might put a switch inside, so then when the kids swipe with a card or something, it can be hooked up to the um, the sound recorder. So some kind of a Marcus munition sound bite. Or... Um, so since we're in the lockdown still, I want to talk about that. Uh, we this is basically, I mean, I've got a couple more sheets, but they're even smaller. So I'm just basically chopping this up to make the top panel. So there'll be a seam there. I'll split it up. So this is it, that's the panel that we got, a little notch here for this bit so it actually fits nicely. Um, it's not, I mean it's probably about the same quality as the rest of the machine to be honest. So it sits here, so if I spin it around, Ah, okay, so I'll just bash this one down a bit just to make it flush. Okay. So it actually is pretty, it, it just touches the top. I might actually need to bend this a tiny bit. It's a little bit lower there, but it's adding that one mil plate underneath just to space it was actually quite a good idea. Cool, so that's actually pretty good. Lines up from the sides quite well. The front is pretty good and this gap is basically a mil. It's very consistent. Not car consistent, but it's consistent for let off quality I guess. So this is my cutout for the for the card reader. So I'll see if uh, the idea is that this part, so that's the left and right, I'll bend it across here, twist, turn that in, see this what I've got so far. That's the, sorry it will kind of go like this and now I'm just going to bend it along here and then bend that across so that actually comes up to there. one cool so that's two so there we go So here's the first one. Now we're just gonna spot on this bit and then probably just grind it up a bit. Um, make it a bit tidier. And 
this is the backing plate. Now, what I thought to make this functional, I've actually put the switch in the back and I put it flush just so the button is showing. Then what I'll do is I'll place these and I'll spot them. So then the idea is, is that the width of the gap will be the width of this button. And then it means that if the kids are swiping anything, whatever, cards or whatever else fits through there, I assume just, just any, any kind of card, that'll press the button which will complete the circuit and the, you know, I'll get, I've got another little mp3 box thing coming in so um, that'll trigger Marcus's voice. So this is what I've ended up with. Um, it's, I think it's okay for what we're going for. And of course the switch, you can just see it through the back there. And I can always replace it if it's the wrong one. So what I'll do is I've got these uh, four uh, M6 bolts that came off. I have no idea what, but they all are the same. Yeah, making these sides on hinges was definitely worth it, just for accessibility. here so it lines up pretty good I've got the ventilation holes here sort of like in the screenshot but because this is a separate panel they don't go um, as low but the pattern is the same um, and the card reader is done looks pretty good so yeah uh, um, there might be a few weeks break until the next update because I have to wait until the lockdown is over so I can get some more steel to do the top and the back but uh yeah thanks very much for watching